Hi friends, today I wanted to share an incident which occurred in my life long time back and it gives me immense joy to share this story as an opportunity to relish those feelings back at this moment. Eric was my neighbor who lived happily with his parents and wife with his economical basic necessities fulfilled. He had a job and seemed satisfied with his life whenever I looked and perceived on my end. Suddenly he lost himself and started behaving very different with his family and friends. He never confined in anybody and his family started worrying about him very much. He had developed a lonely attitude and never met anyone. He never attended parties or public gatherings and even quit his job and started developing suicidal tendencies. This is when his parents persuaded me to find out the cause of the worry. After weeks of persuasion I found out that Eric was suffering from a skin disease called psoriasis which eventually broke his confidence and had developed a low esteem attending public gatherings. But the great Lord helped him overcome the situation with the support from his friends and family and with proper medical advice. Additional precautions was been carried out and now he is leading a very happy life again. Do you know what psoriasis is and what are the precautionary measures to overcome it? In this video we find out complete details about the disease and I will provide you complete tips if followed. You will also overcome the same and gain your confidence back. I request viewers to please subscribe and share this video to someone who might be going through a bad patch of his life whom you know and share the happiness around. Please watch the complete video for a proper understanding of the disease and please do not abandon, deliberately avoid and ignore them as they are in need of great support from our community to regain the confidence in their hope in life again. Thank you. Psoriasis Overview How does psoriasis appear? Psoriasis is a skin condition that typically affects the knees, elbows, trunk, and scalp. It generates a rash with itchy, scaly spots. Psoriasis is a frequent, chronic condition that has no cure. It may hurt, keep you up at night, and be difficult to focus on. The illness frequently goes through cycles where it will flare up for a few weeks or months before decreasing. Infections, cuts, burns, and specific drugs are common psoriasis triggers in persons with a hereditary predisposition to the condition. There are treatments available to assist you in managing symptoms. In order to cope better with your psoriasis, you can also attempt different lifestyle choices and coping mechanisms. Symptoms. Small scaling spots, often seen in children, dry, cracked skin that may bleed, itching, burning, or soreness are common signs and symptoms of psoriasis. A patchy rash that varies greatly in appearance from person to person includes rashes that vary in color, tending to be shades of purple with gray scale on brown or black skin and pink or red with silver scale on white skin, circadian rashes that peak for a few weeks or months before going away. Psoriasis comes in a variety of forms, and each one has unique indications and symptoms. Psoriasis plaque. Plaque psoriasis, the most prevalent type of psoriasis, results in scale-covered, dry, elevated skin patches, plaques. They could be few or numerous. They typically show up on the scalp, lower back, elbows, and knees. Depending on the skin tone, the patches have different colors. On dark or black skin, the afflicted skin may heal with transient color changes, post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation. Psoriatic nails. Pitting, irregular nail growth, and discoloration can all be brought on by psoriasis and affect both fingernails and toenails. The nail bed may become loose and separate from psoriatic nails, onycholysis. The nail may break if the illness is severe. Guttate psoriasis. Young people and children are most commonly affected with guttate psoriasis. Usually, a bacterial infection, like strep throat, is what sets it off. 
small, drop-shaped scaling lesions on the trunk, arms, or legs are its telltale sign. Psoriasis in reverse. The groin, buttocks, and breast skin folds are mostly impacted by inverse psoriasis. It results in scaly, inflammatory skin patches that get worse with friction and perspiration. This kind of psoriasis may be brought on by fungi. Psoriasis with pustules. An unusual form of pustular psoriasis results in distinct pus-filled blisters. On the palms or soles, it may appear in little patches or in larger ones. Psoriasis with erythrodermia. Ethrodermic psoriasis, the least frequent form of the condition, can cover the entire body in a peeling rash that can itch or burn severely. It may be acute, short-lived, or chronic, chronic. Whenever to visit a doctor, consult a medical professional if you think you might have psoriasis, or in addition, when it gets worse or spreads widely, you experience pain and discomfort, you worry about how your skin looks, it doesn't go better with treatment. It gets worse or spreads widely. Causes. Skin cells typically grow slowly, but in psoriasis, skin cells grow more quickly than usual. Due to this quick cell turnover, the most prevalent type of psoriasis, plaque psoriasis, develops dry, scaly areas. The exact cause of psoriasis is unknown. It is believed to be an immune system issue wherein infection-fighting cells unintentionally kill healthy skin cells. Both genetics and environmental factors are thought to be involved. The illness is not spread by others. Psoriasis catalysts. Prior to the condition being brought on by an environmental component, many people who are prone to psoriasis may go years without experiencing any symptoms. Typical causes of psoriasis include the weather, especially if it's cold and dry, infections like strep throat or skin infections, Skin damage, including cuts, scrapes, bug bites, or severe sunburn. Smoking and exposure to secondhand smoke. Heavy alcohol use. Some medications, including as lithium, blood pressure medications, and anti-malarial medications. Rapid discontinuation of oral or injectable corticosteroids. Risk elements. Psoriasis can strike anyone. A third of incidents start while children are young. These elements may raise a person's risk of contracting the illness. Ancestral history. The illness is inherited in families. Your likelihood of developing psoriasis is increased if one of your parents has the condition. Additionally, your risk is further increased if both of your parents have psoriasis. Smoking. Smoking not only raises the likelihood of developing psoriasis, but it may also make the condition worse. Complications. You run a higher chance of developing additional disorders if you have psoriasis, such as psoriatic arthritis, which results in joint discomfort, stiffness, and swelling. Transient changes in skin tone, post-inflammatory hypo or hyperpigmentation, after plaques have healed. Diabetes type 2. Obesity conjunctivitis, blepharitis, and uveitis of the eyes, high blood pressure. Conditions affecting the eyes, such as conjunctivitis, blepharitis, and uveitis, obesity, type 2 diabetes, hypertension, and cardiovascular disease. Other autoimmune illnesses such as celiac disease, sclerosis, and the inflammatory bowel disorder known as Crohn's disease, mental health issues like depression and low self-esteem. Always heed your doctor's instructions if you have psoriasis. Nevertheless, there are many things you may do on your own to manage and stop flare-ups. Please continue watching for more information and tips and please share the information to people who need them. Finally we provide you with important precautions to be followed in addition to your doctor's advice if you have psoriasis. Nevertheless, there are many things you may do on your own to manage and stop flare-ups. 1. Apply hydrating lotions. Keep your skin moisturized with creams and lotions to prevent symptoms from worsening when it's dry. Typically, thick, greasy ones like petroleum jelly work best. 
they do a better job of keeping moisture under the skin trapped. Apply cream over scales to aid in their removal, then wrap the region in plastic wrap or another water-resistant material. After a few hours, leave it on and take it off. Find out more about psoriasis creams and other topical treatments. 2. Look after your scalp and skin. Take care of your skin. Never pick at patches or scales because doing so could exacerbate your psoriasis. When cutting your nails, exercise caution. Cutting yourself could cause symptoms to worsen. Rub topical medications, such as tar shampoos, into your scalp if you have psoriasis on your scalp. Regular baths with calming ingredients, such tar solutions, may also provide relief. Learn how to select a medicated shampoo for psoriasis of the scalp. 3. Prevent cold, dry weather. Psoriasis can be greatly impacted by the climate. Cold, dry weather exacerbates symptoms for many people. It normally gets better when it's hot outside, but not always. Learn more about treating psoriasis in the fall and winter. 4. Employ a humidifier. Maintaining moisture in your skin is crucial. When the air in your home is dry, turn on the humidifier. Learn how to use humidifiers and about the various varieties that are available. 5. Steer clear of drugs that trigger flare-ups. Tell your doctor about all of your prescription and over-the-counter medications. Ask if they might have an impact on your psoriasis. The following medications are known to worsen the situation, lithium, which is used to treat psychiatric illnesses. The beta blockers propranolol and perhaps others that are prescribed for heart issues. Quinidine, a drug for erratic heartbeat. Ask your doctor about alternatives if you're using any of these medications. Learn about medications that can cause psoriasis flare-ups, including the mentioned. 6. Keep cuts, scrapes, bumps, and infections at bay. Psoriasis sufferers should take additional care to avoid wounds and bumps, it can flare up as a result of skin trauma. Problems can also result from infections. Take extra caution when shaving. Do your best to avoid getting tattoos and acupuncture, as well as insect bites and chafing. 7. Enjoy a little sun, but not too much. Getting moderate amounts of sun is beneficial because the UV rays in sunlight decrease the formation of skin cells. However, keep it short, about 20 minutes at a time. Also, wear sunscreen. Sunburn increases your risk of developing skin cancer and can cause psoriasis. Consult your doctor first as some drugs may increase your skin sensitivity to UV light. Learn more about the hazards and advantages of exposure to sunlight for psoriasis. 8. Reduce stress. Many people believe that stress causes flare-ups, even though this has not been confirmed. So make an effort to calm your worry. Although it may be easier said than done, you might start by practicing relaxing techniques like yoga or meditation. Learn how to handle the psychological effects of having psoriasis. 9. Monitor your alcohol consumption and cut down tobacco. Although the relationship between alcohol and psoriasis is unclear, some believe it can exacerbate symptoms, particularly in men. Cut down the use of tobacco as it aggravates the situation. 10. Keep your weight healthy by exercising and eating right. Although there is no evidence linking food and psoriasis, doctors advise those who suffer the condition to consume a well-balanced diet rich in fruits and vegetables. Some claim that cutting out dairy or gluten helps their symptoms. Exercise could be beneficial. According to certain research, being overweight can cause flares, therefore maintain a healthy weight. Banana skin owns beneficial value for health, rub banana skin on the affected areas as a face skin supplement and treatment value. The aggravated area will subside and settle. In addition, Epsom salt bath has been practiced to treat various ailments including psoriasis. We will discuss the benefits of Epsom salt in another video so. 
please comment below if you want a separate video only on Epsom salt benefits. Finally take care of yourself, stay happy and spread happiness around. Cheers. Thanks for watching and giving your valuable time. Please like, share, comment and subscribe to keep our motivation going. Cheers.